Welcome to Simulator Adventures and welcome to Revhead. Now this is a car racing simulation game, but you have to buy your own cars and tweak them with different components. So basically you build your own car, your own racing car. Um, I'm really looking forward to getting into this, there's a lot to talk about, a lot to see. I haven't played this yet, so let's get going. Now my name is Jack, skill beginner. I've got five grand, that's not a lot, um, and this game is set in Australia, as you can hear by the um, didgeridoos, and you can see that by the kangaroo in the start menu. Anyway, in the middle of the Chrissy holidays, you get a postcard from Uncle Charlie. He just moved to a little outback town called Nordu, out in Whoop Whoop, in Australia. Charlie is one of the most famous race car drivers in Australia for yonks, winning the Revhead title heaps of times. After he chucked in racing, he became a mechanic, and kept, his teams, uh, kept the teams he worked with winning as well. Now he's gone and opened his own garage with his own racetrack, the backyard out the back. Charlie knows your love of cars and he needs a hand to get the business up and, run, uh, up and running. He's invited you to come to Australia to check out the business and lend him a hand. Your job would be to build cars in his garage and race them on nearby tracks. To promote his new track and kick off your career as a driver and mechanic. You know you're strapped for cash so you're going to have to use your noggin to get creative if you want to stick around for long. Charlie can put you up to work in his garage to make extra dough while you find cars and parts in the local rag and use Charlie's garage to fix them up. Hanging around the garage and the track grabs the attention of the local racers, challenge them and beat them to take, your, uh, to take their money or their rides. It's like pink slips, I guess. It hits you that you can make good money and be a part of something special that you wouldn't find anywhere else. You learn, um, you learn more and more about cars and driving and become a real member of Revhead Society. Be the best and earn the title of Revhead. So like I said, my first time playing, it's my first impressions of this game. Here we are, Australia. Got a postcard, I think, here, wow. G'day, mate. I'm not gonna do a, an accent, actually, no. How are you going? Uh, haven't seen you for yonks. How's your old man? Tell, I, tell him Charlie says good day. I just moved to Nordu, a real little slice of heaven for me. Every weekend there are races on the go. And with your love of cars, you should get over here. It's gonna be a flat out summer, so come give us a hand. See you when I'm looking at you, Charlie. I'm from Centre. Me in Budapest? Wow, okay. Glad you made it. This is Nordu, a tiny town with quite some races around. We're going to need a real re uh, racing beast to beat them. But first things first, let's see how we could get there. Are you ready to get stuck in? Yeah, but what are we doing? Well, I just bought this place with the garage and petrol station. I also own the land out back. Out back. No, out the back. Sorry. I want to build race cars, so I knock together a track back at, uh, out back for, of the servo for testing cars and racing. People notice the backyard. There's a lot to do. I could use some help around here. So there's a lot of like slang and terms I'm not familiar with. But anyway, um, I have a mate who wants to get his hands on a ripper of a Walia. Is that a car? Yeah, it's a low-end car, but a lot of fun. It's got top-notch reputation. Okay, you want to give us a hand to chuck one together for him? I sure do. Start a tutorial. So, we're in the garage. Right, pick a cheap wall here. I know it looks small, but it's light and can even squeeze in a V8. Nice. Take a sticky beak at the newspaper and find something cheap, but make sure it's not completely stuffed. Oh dear. Well, so these are all the used cars. There's a lot of them, actually. Look at that. An off-roader, a supercharger. Oh, 116 grand for that one. A used kanji. A, wa a wanja. <laughs> Some of these names. There's a wrecked one. We see there's a heavily used, or, but the wrecked one. Oh, it's a special edition, right? God, these cars are like eight, 57. Wow, okay. Right, 75 Walia is the one we want to buy. Uh, 130 horsepower. Uh, fuel consumption. I don't use kilometers per litre, but. Or litres per kilometre, sorry. Anyway, 3.6 grand. Right. When you buy a car, you can find it in his garage or outside Charlie's parking place. You can use the parking icon or walking icon to get there. If you need more parking spaces, you can extend it with new garages in Nordu. Right. Give her the once over. Right. Click on the car info button. So 1.2 tons. We've got the payload weight, mileage, 266,000 kilometers. Uh, yeah, kilometers. So that's not bad. 128 horsepower. Yeah, that's fine. I need to know the car before. Right. Have a look over here. This is the project. We've got to wash the car, replace the engine, fix the engine, clogged filters, perform small services. Nice. Okie dokie. Right. Check out the car in more detail. The repair button. All right. Looking around, looking around. Looks good, actually. I don't like the color, but... Um, bush bashing. I've got to wash it. Right. 
Comes so much damage or rust it has. Gonna have that murk in a bit. Yeah, we've washed it. Yeah, the body is kind of rusty. That's not good. All right, paint work. We've got to do that. Right, get the car running smoothly first. Right, lift the car up. Up it goes. Oh, yeah. Right, we can look at the parts. We're going to swap the L4 for a V6. Nice. It's got a bit more guts. So, at a straight four, we can remove the engine. 2.2 2 litres, this one, actually. That's quite cool. All right. So, what we need in the inventory. There's the SL4. It's practically a new engine, actually. Right, we should buy a V6. So, there's a complete V6 engine there. I'll take it. Uh, click on the red sphere in the car. There it is. Right, we can fit it with the V6. Install. Right, the red sphere shows missing parts. Okie dokie. Let's get it sorted out. Select it first and select the V6. We've done that. Select the engine and click fix. There you go. We need a new exhaust that matches to the V6 distribution. Click on the mid pipe and select remove. Click on the mid pipe and select remove. Is that the mid pipe? Uh oh. That's the gearbox. Right, where? There it is. Right, so just follow the exhaust back. Uh, mid pipe, there you go. Remove. Right, now buy a complete Wallia Y exhaust and Wallia V6 exhaust manifold. So, next page, next page. There it is. Right. Manifold and complete exhaust. I'll take it and I'll take it. Right, select the engine and install the manifold. Install. Right. Install the exhaust to the tip. There's the red sphere. Install. Okay, we've got an exhaust. Right. Engine's not ready without clean filters. Buy new air and oil filters and replace them just like you did with the engine. Right. Filters, filters, filters. There they are. New oil filter, new air filter. Right. Remove the oil filter and remove the air filter. Boom. Right. Install. You see that? That one was good. Whatever. Install. And install. See, they were, they seemed fine to me. Anyway. Right. Replace. Okie dokie, we're done here, let's get the car down. Oh my goodness. Right, quick service time. So to check the oil, water and air pressure. Click on each icon and fix them. Right, so air pressure. Um, well we need to... Get it in the green. Okie dokie. Oil. Uh, we're just going to do normal oil. The oil is black as the... Uh oh. Gonna do a full clean. There you go. All's good. Whoops, I accidentally just spent a bit on oil there. Uh, water. Let's fill it up. Oh my goodness, we've done it. We have done it. Right, what now? Uh, she's running, but some, but rough as gut. Something's still stuffed. Okay. Smoke. Yep. Yeah, yeah just pretty smoky, isn't it? Um, I reckon the timing is all over the joint, like a two-bob watch. Oh, this, this slang. Right, trim the timing by moving the needle into the middle. Okay. There you go. Almost there. Only missing a snazzy paint job. Nice. Click on the paint icon, select a colour, then click pay. Right, what colour do we want? Ooh, a red. Sexy... Maroony red. Oh, I like that. Click the back icon to get paid. Huh? Doing top notch custom cars for customers is always a good way to help the business. It's a piece of cake, but don't forget you can place all the parts on the car. Building a race car is not about swapping an engine, but making all the parts work together. She's a beauty, my mate, stoked with it. Right. I hope we can build more cars. Here's a few bucks. I know you're pretty skint. Should we have to build a car for you? Oh, we got three grand. That was cool. So that was the tutorial. You're an Aussie now, mate. You're going to need a pair of fongs and a decent ride. Oh, my God. 
I'm building a car since a while. It should be good for you to get started. It's ready to race, but the engine needs some attention. Righto, I'm all over it. Beat the time of the backyard. It's just behind the garage. Show something to the locals. Keep the engine and suspensions in good shape and make sure the filters and oil are all good. Let's go to the track. Oh my goodness, we're going. Right. First car. We're in. I don't know the controls, but we're off. Uh, oh, I've just reset the... Okay, I've got the gearing now. Right, can I restart? Can I restart? Okay. L l right. Hold on, before we begin. I need to know... Uh, if, I if I click main menu, options, here we go. Right, auto shifter, I don't need that. Let's, t let's put it to fant fantastic. And let's set and increase the FOB, FOB just a bit to 70. Uh, audio, right. Th there are no control... Oh, no, here we go. Right, steering is... Right, accelerate, brake, handbrake, clutch. Well, I need to clutch. We've got a horn. Oh, my goodness. I can't wait for this. Okie dokie. We've turned the graphics up. Right, restart. We got a horn. I love games when they have the horn. Oh, that's not the that's not the button I was looking for. Right, there's the exterior view. Oh, here I am. Look at me. I'm a badass. Yeah, pretty cool car. So we're just on this dirt kind of track here. I've got to get twenty seven. I think that's possible. The engine temperature's a little high. I mean, it's not in the middle, but that's fine. Oh, damn it. I reckon we can easily get this 27. Right, down a second. And that's first. Yes, we did it. 23, 24, 25, 26, 27. Right, new lap record. Let's do one more lap. That was our best yet, that, that sector. Uh-oh. Something doesn't sound right. I think, I think it's dying. We should stop after this lap. Okay. How many laps do we have to do? I don't know. Ooh. Can we come up into the pits? Into the pit lane. Nice. That's the that's the lights. I've just turned the engine off. Right. Stop the race. Continue. Well, uh, that was just my first car. So I'm gonna be a practice or a time trial. A time trial. Well, I can get. I think first car. Is there really money with that? Dude, it's just some test laps. Okay. That's fine with me. So if we go back to the garage. Right, you can see how she's running on a small dirt track. Let's make some vital modifications to make it hard hitting for the first few races. Okie dokie. Project. Right. We've got to fix the engine. We've got to repair the carburetor. We've got to switch to off-road tyres. We've got to mount a front sway bar. Set the tyre pressure. Ignition timing. Beat the time on the backyard. Right. Okie dokie. So first thing we've got to do, fix the engine. So. That's all my parts. Let's get this up on the ramp. Or the lifter. Uh, right, fix the engine. There you go, engine is fixed. Right, repair the carburetor. I think it's gonna be... Where is it? Carburetor, carburetor. There it is. Fix. Done that. Right, switch to off-road tyres. Well, I don't think I'm gonna have off-road tyres, to be honest. No. So we need to go to the newspaper. This is really cool. I'm loving this so far. If you look at the Steam page, actually, there's not like an amazing amount of 
positive Steam reviews when you scroll down. Even though the game is rated very positive, most of the reviews are from like the first year of this game's development. So, or like the first year it was out on Steam. So, uh, back then it was probably not as good as the game as it is now, but it's still being updated. So, you know, this feels great so far. I think I'll do a couple more videos on this. Um, a set of new off-road tyres. Yes. Okie dokie. Right. Remove. Oh. Um. Uh. Oh. oh. Right. We can only install this off. Are they all the same? Yeah, they're all the same. Install. Right. Remove. And install. To be honest, the grip felt okay um, with these non-off-road tyres, but you know, what do I know? Right, off-road tyres, done that. Okay, buy and mount a 20mm front sway bar, okie dokie. So this is the sway bar, so it's only 14mm, right? Remove, and we've got to get the sway bar. Sway bar, where would it be? Oh, goodness. Suspension. Sway bar, sway bar. Used front. Right, hold on a minute. Buy and mount a 20mm front sway bar. Right. So, sway bar. Wallier. 22. Used rear. That's 40. That's 14. No, 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 no. That's a rear sway bar. Ten, Ten millimeters. Hmm. That's rear, though. It did say front, didn't it? Buy and mount a 20... Right, okay. Hold on a minute. I can't see it. I'll be honest. Don't find it. Buy a new paper or visit the local store. Well, how do I buy a new paper? There you go. Ah, new paper, right. Perfect. Okay, 20 millimeter. All right, we're gonna set the tire pressure. So, get this car down. Uh, we've gotta set it to 2.2 to 2.8. 2.2. No, that was it. Okay, so let's set the ignition timing. That's not the ignition timing. Um, no, 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 no. Well, we can give it a clean for a start. There you go. Uh, ignition timing, which one was that? Isn't it that one? I don't know, but the oil's fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's fine. The battery, we can probably charge them a bit more. Uh, right, so do we have to get it on the ramp to do the ignition timing? I don't know. Might do. Hmm. Probably not. Let's start the engine then. Right, engine started. Ignition timing is now perfect. Right, your little beauty is ready to get some serious dirt competition. Go to the backyard for another run to feel the difference. Beat that time limit to get paid. Okie dokie. Right. It's, uh, this one, then. Right, we got a beat. 27.5. Oh, that's better. Wow, that made a big difference. You see, one of the good things about this is that you can... You can feel the difference. I don't know what my summer cars really like, so I've never got to the point where I, um... Actually built the car, but I assume you can like change parts out and stuff. So maybe it's a bit like that. But in this, what I was worried about is that all the cars were going to feel the same, no matter what you put in them or on them. Um, but this feels good. I mean, like, the, the grip is way better. When you turn in, it just grips. Even though I know we're off road, but oh yes. Alright, beat the time. Let's see if we can do even better. 
you know, there's a lot of people I'd like to recommend this game to, but maybe this video will help this game get out there a bit more on the internet, because there's not too many videos on this game. I think this is, a, this is an undiscovered racing game so far. Only about 300 Steam reviews, but really cool so far. Loving it. And it's running well. Right, we did it. Backyard first car is unlocked. Um. Good on you, mate. I think it's time for some more power. Check out the newspaper or shops for cars and parts. You can salvage parts from wrecks or used cars. Make sure your first car... Uh, sorry. Make sure your car is fast enough before you're going to risk it. Right. We got paid 10 grand. Yes. It better work. It's going to be the perfect race car. Okie dokie. So what does this button do? Oh, my goodness. We can drive freely. Right, so where are we going to go? Is that, can I change um, visuals? Vertical sync I want on because I need that in games. Because of, um, what's it called? Free sync or V-sync. So can we get out? Next driver, gear six unassigned. So you could you could have um run. Can you get out of the car? Run. I think you can get out of the car. Headlight switch is start, look left, toe. Right. How, how would I go about getting out of the car? FPS, no, G, that's horn. Ah, oh, it's reset. T one two. It's a cool camera. Z X Z. I think that's X is the um clutch. Um, I'm not sure actually. Maybe that's just something that uh, turn right, turn left, walk forward, walk back, run. Nah, I don't. See, I don't see a get out the car button. But anyway. Uh, let's go to Imalona Desert. Let's have a look at this, um... Oh, wow. Here we are in the town. Are there people around? Woo! There's a kangaroo! Open today. Official tyre shop. Oh my goodness, we can come in here. Uh, I'm looking for tyres and rims. Uh, off-road street. Rims. Oh my god, they sell rims. Oh my goodness. I'm gonna love this game. Well, I can tell you now, stick around on this channel because I'm gonna be playing a lot of this. Oh, classic auto parts. Nice, nice, nice. Let's go over there. So how big is this map? Uh, I'm looking to hot up my car. I do not sell any Euroa parts. Oh, okay. Um... Uh, they, don't, they don't sell... Oh, generic. A thermostat, a cooling fan. Well, nah. Um, let's go on the main road, then. There must be, like, a fuel station, I guess. There's a pub. Yep, the gas station. Let's fill her up. Fill this baby up. Uh, fill her up. Nice one. Okay, so let's get driving. Oh my goodness. Are there like police and things? Wow, we're, we're, we're going out of the way here. So yeah, this has been Revhead. Um, I've done about 20 minutes of this now. I need to improve the brakes by the looks of it. Um, but I, you know what? So far, wow, is all I can say. This is going to keep my interest, and I, right after this, I'm going to record another episode, because I need to do more on this. Um, I wish that I could change the units, but I, I'm, I'm going to have to have a look at what 5 kilometers, uh, 5 litres, so power 100 kilometers actually is. But this map is huge. What's down here? The desert. I mean, there's... Here's Imalona, a great dirt trek. Pull in and have a go. Uh, oh, how do I? Um, oh, here comes the it comes the kangaroo. I was having a 
it's eating some dirt. <laughs> Pull in and have a go. It did say that, didn't it? Yeah, in Malona. I, I Perhaps I can't go here yet. No, I, I think it's um, it's closed. Let's keep driving. Gutter Raceway Park. Interesting. And that's what we'll pick up from next time. So, yeah. Thank you very much for watching. Come and join my Discord server because I do monthly giveaways. Um, and, yeah, stick around for some more rev heads because I will certainly be doing at least one more video on this game. Just a good bit of fun, I think. So, yeah, thank you very much for watching and I will see you soon for some more simulator adventures. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to see more content from my channel and check out these videos to see more simulation gaming on Simulator Adventures.